Can I sip your chai? Yeah, of course. Man, we got our daily morning chai walla chai oat milk latte unlock. You know what it is. <laughs> it's a bit of a chai cauldron too. It's like a little more of a cup. It's very delicious. All right, chalice. A, a chai chalice. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to this week's video. I'm Nicholas. I'm Aubrey. And we are the Matinees. We're currently three, four-ish weeks deep into a van build. So we've been traveling the Americas for the last three years. Mm -hmm. And now we're back home in Texas and we're working on a new van build. We are building this van for you guys, for the whole van life community because we've been so blessed to have so many incredible experiences on the road. We want to share that with you guys a little bit. So if you're interested in taking the van you are about to see get built out on the road for yourself for free once it's completed, all of the details on how to do that are in the description box and I highly encourage you to go check it out please guys because we want to get this van in the hands of the right people who will enjoy it and show it some love. So the people behind this project is actually this company called Moonfab and we are collaborating with them on this whole entire project. So they're putting this on. They make some awesome, awesome awnings. They're called the Moonshade. You might've heard of them by now right. if you've been around for a second. And um, if you are in need of shade in your life to put on literally any rig or in any situation at all, that link is also in the description box below if you want to support a great company. Week three on the van builds. Yeah. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. I feel like we're just now starting to get to the place where we can, we're almost done with the box. Yeah. And we can start to build furniture very soon. Yes, right. We're getting there. So the goal of this week is just to make a nice, beautiful box. Mm -hmm. A beautiful, beautiful box and wheels. So are you ready for week three? Yes. I am very, very ready. This is becoming, we, we've entered the fun part of the project, I think. I'm already yeah, really enjoying all of it. Yeah, it's so life. true. I feel like everything we do now, you can see visually yeah. the the new stuff that we're doing. And the it feels like we're, we're making some progress. Right. So I think this week, the main goal is just to complete the box. Yes. And make sure that it's ready to start building furniture onto. Today's task is going to be to put the ceiling in. And instead of making mm. you destroy your arms and hold up the ceiling the entire time. Yeah. I'm just going to phone in some muscle. I'm going to oh. call my little brother Caleb and have him work on it. I love that idea. Okay. <laughs> we walked down this morning to work on the van and it turns out we got some new neighbors. This is what we're looking at. Ripping up the sidewalk. Caleb. What up? What do you think of the new neighbors? They're making me kind of upset because I can't play my music while right. we do the van and they're right. loud and now my music is just a hammer. A uh, jackhammer for 10 hours. Yeah, a jackhammer for true, 10 true, hours. True, true, true. And it was fine. Like, I mowed the grass. True. Like, we always mow it and take care of the grass. Right. And then they just come in with their shovels. They ripped up our grass. I'm sad. But yeah. I, but it's okay. It'll Are you ready to build a van with me though? Hi. Let's, Let's go. do it. Hot. It's hot, huh? Very hot in the van, I but know. that means it's insulated well. No, it doesn't. That means it's insulated badly. Oh, really? It's not supposed to be hot. But the panels, the doesn't panels. that like trap the heat in? <laughs> it's supposed to repel the heat away. But like polar bears have like the fat to keep <laughs> No, they do. They no, have, but, but, like, but bears insulation have, like, is supposed in, to keep you, those. it keeps you warm when it's cold or cooler when it's warm. So this is, it's a, well then I guess we just have to fix it and work no, on okay, the Okay, that's it, that is it for sure. So on the roof we're gonna be doing these one foot poplar boards, three across and all the way down. You ready to get working? Let's do this. not to get satisfied videos like one of the actual people and I feel like I'm one of those makers now
Unfortunately, Caleb is heading out after a great day of helping us get the ceiling up. I'm gonna work on the rest of the ceiling. Construction crew's not going anywhere, so I guess we're plugging along. I'll see y'all later. Thanks, Caleb. I got you. <laughs> All of our neighbors are gone for the night. Yay, and this neighbor's back. Are you halfway tempted to go write your name in the wet cement? In front of our home? That's a pretty tempting offer. Is anyone around? I don't feel like I need to imprint my name on everything. Okay. You know what I'm All saying? Right, but well. like, it's kind of an opportunity that I need to entertain. That doesn't yeah, come yeah, yeah. You got about another two hours to entertain it, so. Okay. <laughs> we are going to work on the ceiling pieces. Um, now, there's these little like ridges up here. It would just be so satisfying if we could basically cut around these ridges so yeah. that the ceiling is directly on top of the walls and right. there's not like a gap at all. Got your PPE? <laughs> yep. <laughs> I don't have all that. Sorry, here, I'll, I'll give you some oh. of mine. Oh, okay. No, you can have it. No, it's all good. No, you're hearing... I'll protect my lungs protection. and you protect... <laughs> I does it. <laughs> yeah, it's already damaged. Oh, uh, it's true. Okay. <laughs> Alright friends, so we still got our neighbors in the back here, still a little bit noisy, but you know it means that our noise just kind of blends in for the whole neighborhood, so you win some, you lose some. Um, I am going to start working on the divvying up of what's going to be under our platform. There's going to be a platform right here at the back of the van and this is what the, the couch um, and like the whole seating table area is going to be built on. But we're going to have a lot of storage. Um, under here so that's where you can see our all of our wires are sitting here waiting for our batteries and electrical setup um, we have a big water tank that's gonna go right under here and yeah it's just gonna take a little bit of organization back here um, a little bit of calculating so let's get going What you working on over here? Well, actually, I just finished. Okay. Um, my beautiful drawing. Yes. Of how we're going to organize the platform. Underneath the platform. Exactly, underneath the platform. So we got electrical, a big long drawer for like gear storage, our plumbing water tank set up. We're gonna have a very fancy little step right here. It's all gonna come together, and it's gonna be so satisfying when it does. Yeah. This is going to be the first time using this table saw, which is very exciting. We have been talking about getting a table saw and breaking out a table saw for our next build for like the two years that we've been knowing there's a next build. So <laughs> this is a couple of years in the making. I'm very excited about it. I'm so excited about it. Got a PPE out for sure for this one. <laughs> I think we know how it works. I think we've got it down. Our well, first piece of cutting wood. We'll just see if we can get some beginners off. <laughs> Right. 
Oh wait, hold on, hold on. Go for it, go for it. Wow, yes. Oh my god. Woo! Satisfying, huh? Wow. like this going straight up all the way across here and then a couple of other vertical pieces like this and that is basically going to be the support for our platform on the top there's gonna to be a lot of weight on the platform so we've got to make sure this is as much weight bearing as steady as secure as possible the way that we're doing that is with pocket holes which are just unbelievably strong and we've done them all the way along down the bottom of the wood right there right there right there and on the other side. And then we also did them on the other side, of course. And then preemptively, because we're thinking ahead this mm. build, we did them on the top so that when it's time to put the top on, we'll just be able to zip it right in. So it's pretty simple. If you're building a van and you use L brackets like we used to, <laughs> it's time to stop because <laughs> pocket screws are unreal. Wow. Stand alone and it's so strong. Just imagine when it has other pieces like this. Oh my word. Damn, that is nice. I am so pleased with that. Give us the final tour of the week's work, babe. Bro, this is awesome. I'm so excited. I feel so accomplished with this because this is like our pe first piece of like furniture. Yeah, yeah, I do too. Yeah. Okay, okay. show me around. This platform. is the base of the platform while also providing a lot of organization. Basically, where I'm standing is going to be a huge storage drawer. We're going to have our water pump here and all of our plumbing. All of our electrical will be right here. And then you can see we have these little divots. This is where we'll put the step so that, you know, you don't have to step so high up. Right. You can, well, you can take that a little bit at a time. Right, right, right. I love it. Once we get everything kind of configured underneath here next week, we're planning to top this off. Also, we have finished the ceiling and it is super, super sturdy. I secured it in up here with soft tapping screws. So all this is totally packed in. Feeling really, really good. Nice. And last but not least, this week we were hooked up by some friends of ours over at Van Essentials. They make these beautiful custom cut, what, what do you call them? Like window, window guards? Covers, window covers, I guess, covers, yeah. Window guards. Oh, wow. Yeah, they're magnetic, and so they just seal right onto the window, and they keep it extremely well insulated. So shout out to these guys for hooking it up. You can find more about them in the description, obviously. This water tank, which is a 40 galloner. That's a lot of water. It's a lot of water That'll indeed. Push it a little further back, babe, right there. So this will be right here, and you'll be able to fill up the water out the back, which will be nice and easy. Check this out, guys. It is so perfect. <laughs> the top is going to be able to go right on this and fit like oh. a dream. Oh, fit like a dream. And then the reason we put this on the side is so that we can run plumbing. So we're, we'll run our plumbing here and kind of through these other structures um, to our kitchen. And the reason that we put it on this side is because we have the batteries over here, so we're trying to balance the weight a little bit. Bottom of the platform is done. Hop up on there and see how sturdy it is. See if you can wobble it. <laughs> what? I know. It's insane how sturdy it is. Hell yeah. You couldn't even kick that over if you tried. No, that would hurt so bad. <laughs> don't, don't want to mess with these. These are strong boys. All right, great day's work, babe. Great day's work. Oh, we got armrests this week. Oh, true. For our outro. Some cubbies to sit in. Right, cubbies. As you can hear, our neighbors never left. 
they're still working away for like the sixth day in a row, so. But we have some nice sidewalks to enjoy from now on. Right. Yeah. You know what, actually, I actually get more into the work spirit when I have all these construction workers around. Yeah, yeah, it's like a whole, you're kind of entering their career a little yeah, bit. Exactly. They're so productive. Yeah, that, I like, don't feel like the one weird neighbor out here like working power tools, they kind of give like a little smoke screen. Yeah, sure, yeah. sure, sure. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you're enjoying this build. As always, you can apply to take this guy out. Eventually when he's done and COVID is not, you know, as much of a problem, the link is in the description. And again, that is to take him out for free, which is going to be provided by Moon Fabrication. So thank you to them again for sponsoring the build and for sponsoring this video. Next week is going to be a banger. <laughs> this build is going to keep slapping. And see you Saturday. Bye.